it is useless to resist. You let yourself be destroyed as only one hit. Me and my team, Creature Bionics, and what we do is specialise in character development and performance for creature fantasy characters, film, TV and video games. And we just come to Comic Con to show off some of the rigs that we make. You can see puppet head, arm extension, tail, mini arms. So we've got a whole, a whole crew here today. This is a full team. This is a full team here. Everybody here is an actor. We're going to specialize in movement. We're going to specialize in creature. We're going to be trained. So, my team. And yeah, we're just going to walk around and you know get the reaction. We can give out some cards, take some pictures. I think uh, motion capture, definitely the imagination and uh, if you get to work together with other actors, especially when it's creature, it just, uh, just feels so real. You can just expand your imagination and play. Just the playing actually, yeah. Playing. Just being free, man, that, that's like the best experience. The moment you get to creature mode or fantasy character mode, you are free. You don't need to think about anything else, you just think about your basic creature instincts. Love it. I'd say that's the best moment, just being in that moment. I mean, look at it, look at it. It's good so far. As soon as you got in, you were kind of attracting a lot of attention. So, just with the team. My name is Lucky McQueedy, I'm with Creature Bionics, and in the dynamics of walking around as a creature, what it is based on is, is the movement of how animals move. And I started studying animals as a young child because I was looking into the remnants of footprints and everything like that, uh, just through archaeology and all that, of uh, wanting uh, to be around dinosaurs. And so in doing so, you started studying the footprints, and dinosaurs are like cats and everything, uh, the, the way they move in packs and stuff. And as they move, cats will walk single file, and the their feet will always land in the front foot paw. So you never know how many there are, and they'll walk in line. It's kind of why sand people in Star Wars were single file. You know, you, you never know how many there are. And it's about studying the ground and knowing that oh, that footprint is this deep. There's a whole herd of them, and that's it, that's just the dynamics of how animals move. You know, a horse moves different than a elephant that moves different than a lizard that moves different than a dog that moves different than a cat that moves different than an ape. And so those are all the base dynamics of how the creature movement goes. But then also you start. prosthetics and then I managed to get a, get a meeting with um, the Imaginarium just after they did um, the first Planet of the Apes film when I, and then I was part of kind of the R&D team for Mowgli uh, and I did Mowgli and then after I'd done that kind of one mocap geek I've always been quite a physical performer and I connected with Ace and Andy Circus and a load of other people Terry Notary I got to work with on that and, and uh, yeah and it's just a very nice 
It's just a nice family to be part of. Something a bit different. Oh, I'll see you later.